Hi and welcome to Spice and Pans. Today we'll be cooking shrimp and tofu pot. So let's start cooking. We are going to start by deep frying our egg tofu. I'm using over here one whole tube of egg tofu. Gently put it inside the oil. One tube of egg tofu is approximately 150 grams. This dish is going to be excellent for Chinese New Year and goes fantastically well with rice. The reason why we are deep frying the tofu is because we want to get rid of the excess liquid inside the tofu as well as to crease up the skin so that you can soak in the beautiful sauce that we will be making later. You can also make your own egg tofu. We have a recipe on that. You can just search spice and pans egg tofu. Be careful when you move them around. Try not to break the tofu. You want to fry them until they are golden brown color. Right, this is the color that we want. So we remove them from the oil now. Set them aside. You pour out the excess oil, but we'll leave one tablespoon of the oil in the pan. We'll now add in our aromatics. Five grams of young ginger sliced. Three pieces of shallots quartered. Just brown them a little. Turn the heat to medium low or medium. We will now add in 3 cloves of garlic chopped as well as 2 dried mushrooms which I've rehydrated and sliced into tiny pieces like this. We will now add in 100 grams of minced meat. I'm using pork over here. Of course, if you don't take pork, you can always use chicken or use beef, no problem at all. Spread them out and brown them a little. We will now add in half a tablespoon of preserved bean paste or tau ching as they call it. I've sliced also 40 grams of carrots. You put them in now. We will now add in some water. Two cups of water. You now add in two tablespoons of light soy sauce, half a teaspoon of chicken stock powder, as well as half a teaspoon of sugar. You will now put the lid on and let them cook for five minutes. Five minutes is up. Let's have a look. Right, beautiful. We give this a taste just to make sure that it is to our liking. Mmm, yummy. You will now add in. 50 grams of sweet peas as well as the tofu that we have deep just now. So that in. I will also add in 150 grams of cauliflower. Put the lid back on and let this just steam for another 30 seconds. 30 seconds is up. Now I'll add in our prawns. I have with me over here 160 grams of prawns which I've desheled and taken out the bean. Just put them in. Okay. You put the lid back on and let it steam for another minute or two until the prawns are cooked. The prawns are almost cooked. Just give them a light stir. Add in some pepper. Now if you want more sauce, we can actually add a little bit more water. But I think this is just fine for me. Now I just need to thicken up this sauce now. Don't thicken it up too much. I'm going to add in one bitter egg in a while. Something like this would be good. Add in one tablespoon of Chinese cooking wine or Shao Xing Jiu. Just splash it by the side. Move them around. Coat them well. And now we add in our egg. Looks and smells fantastic. Turn off the flame. Give it a light stir. We're adding now one teaspoon of sesame oil. And we'll serve this now. I love serving this dish seasoning hot. So I'm going to heat up a clay pot and serve this in a heated clay pot. So I'm just going to transfer all this into my clay pot. This seasoning sound is really music to my ears. I'm just going to chop this up with some chopped spring onions. And it's time to have our lunch. I'm 
Now the dish is done, let's have a taste. Mm, can't wait to try this. There's some gravy on my rice, some tofu, and of course the shrimp. A little bit of vegetable so. Let's try this now. I'm really hungry. The sauce is beautiful. You have the gingery taste, and yet the freshness of the prawns, the sweetness of the carrots are all inside here. It's really good. Let me try the cauliflower. Cooked perfectly. Very, very nice. Tofu has absorbed the sauce nicely too. So ladies and gentlemen, this is how we cook our shrimp and tofu pot. I hope you like our video. Do click like our video and do subscribe to our channel. Thank you for watching.